infantry. They told me 11 x-ray met extra special. <laughs> <laughs> and so when I get to Fort Bay, I'm like, I'm an x-ray. They're like, I'm a Bravo. And I'm like, what's that? They're like, that's real infantry. I'm like, no, it's not. <laughs> they lied to you. <laughs> but when I, when, I got, when I got to Fort Benning, Georgia, the first night, there were kids like crying and, and nervous. I, I slept the best sleep I've ever had in my life in that because I knew this is who I was. This is where I'd be safe. This, I, there was no stress. You know, these kids were like 19, 18. I was like, this is nothing. Oh, what are you worried about? Like, this, this, is what we're, this is why we're here. We're here on this earth. We were born to do this. Now, we don't get a war. That's the part that's going to suck is we're just going to end up with a bumper sticker on our car. <laughs> we're just going to say we're a vet and, and get a free meal at Applebee's. But, but listen, we, 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 we offered. There was nothing for us to do. So you were that you were that fired up like day one of boot camp. I had no idea. Was I wore khakis and a button down shirt because I wanted to impress. <laughs> I wanted to impress my drill sergeant that I was a professional. And they told me that I was going to be there for like fifteen weeks. And so I didn't. I knew I had to shave my head, but I thought I was going to grow back. So I brought a hair dryer. Right? <laughs> when they shook my bag, they're like, what piece of shit brought a hairdryer? I was like, I, this is my first challenge. Like, do I own it? And I'm like, yeah, that's my hairdryer. They told me there was a couple months here. <laughs> I wasn't aware that there was a, a, a payday haircut. Yeah. You didn't tell me that, you know? But, but honestly, I had no idea really what I was getting into. But the more I learned, I just... I looked at these drill sergeants and I was like, D these are amazing. The NCO became, I'm so glad I didn't go officer, honestly, because I saw these NCOs and I was just like, this is everything I've always wanted to be. If I could have a son and I could see a person shoulders back looking you in the eye and not, you know, not waiting to speak, but listening, hearing what's going, and if you don't know the answer, you say, I don't know. Like, wait a minute. What is this magic? If you don't know something, you actually admit that? And then you make a mistake. You say, oh, I, I did that. But you know what? It's not going to happen again. These, this was like learning a new language, a new way to this – was, this was true north. Nothing else is north but that. This is right. This is wrong. And, and own it. Accountable, responsible, and, and ready – for more to show that you're ready for more you take whatever i'm, gu I'm guarding this little drinking fountain but you know what no one is stealing that drinking fountain <laughs> i'm 10 for 10 no fire on my fire guard this is this is it was the greatest thing in the world for me